What's up everybody? Welcome back. Today I'm back out here in the San Francisco Bay. We're we'll going for some sharks. It's a nice cloudy morning. Today we're gonna see if we can catch some more on Jack's Mel. See what happens. Stay tuned. Alright guys, here's our setup for today. I'm using the same rig as last time. Three ounce weight, steel leader, eight ounce circle hook, cut frozen jack smelt. Alright. Gonna cast this out right here on the center of the point. So the tide's a little low right now, but it's starting to come in. So this is the best time. Hopefully hook onto the sharks today. Maybe something else. But highly doubt it. There's probably just gonna be sharks. Alright, we're fishing. Alright guys, so it's been about about an hour. Um, it's about 11 o'clock. The tide is just starting to come in because I looked on the tide here in San Mateo and it said low tide was at 1015. So after now being a little bit slack, it's gonna start coming in. And this should be the time when I start to being hooking up. You know, this is when the time where the sharks are starting to coming in. They usually like to come in here in this shallow cove, just cruising around because I see them all the time on the bridge when I come by or just going for walks and stuff. So hopefully there'll be some big ones coming around and we'll hook onto some giants. So wish me luck. Just got a good hit here. Dang. See if he comes back. Filled it up. I maybe should have let it stay in the water, but you can see there, the shark took a chunk right there. So he didn't really grab onto the hook, but we're gonna rebait, recast, and then hope for another shark. Game bit here. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Not on. on. Okay, here, here. That's a bite. Yep. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, got a runner right here. Oh, it's probably a ray, actually. Is it? I don't know. We'll see. Ooh, see what we got. Oh, he's out there. It's a shark. Yeah, it's a leopard. Big one. It's a big leopard shark. when that brave goes. It's a big shark, dude. This thing's going. God dang, these rocks. I swear if I slip, it's Christ. That's a giant. Get in here. Oh my god, this. Oh man, that's a big leopard. Thing's thick. Oh. Come on. This thing's slippery. Oh my god. Good job. Thanks. It's a big one. Yeah, I gotta get my, see how many inches he is? Right there. Is that 54? 54. 54, let's go. That's my PB. Really? I know. Yeah. Nice. All right. This thing's big, big creator. Oh, god dang, this thing's heavy. I've never, this is the heaviest, shark I've ever gone. All right, go buddy. You're free. There he goes. Wow. All right, man. My back hurts. Oh my. Yeah, I didn't feel the line getting wrapped on the rock, so. My line's fine, plus this is a steel leader. 
that was a fun fight like that shark just ran like crazy he was trying to put me into the rocks over here get me afraid up dude was pretty smart to be honest because he was getting me out of control but luckily i wasn't able to slip and i kept walk, or walking down with the fish and then yeah got tired and got him in so this is what i'm using to catch the sharks just got some jack smell gonna grab one here next what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna i'm gonna cut this head off right here this is probably like the best part of the bait to use oh man i had a feeling this year i was gonna beat my pb again and it i did 54 inches wow that's my longest fish i've probably ever caught in my life i don't know i remember a few years ago i caught a big old shoving nose guitar fish here and that looked very similar like he was so heavy that leopard shark was heavy too he had to been at least at least 20 pounds big catch so yeah i got my jack smelt right here see circle hook did its job i'm gonna just hook it right through here shouldn't be going anywhere it's a big it's a big piece right there for a big fish here we go boom just cast out as far as you can your goal is to just land your bait around the mud line that's where all the sharks are at For a sec, I thought it was a ray because I didn't feel any head shakes, but when the shark took off even more, I felt the head shakes and I knew it had to be a big shark. And then I saw it on the surface out there. All right. Another shark. Oh my God. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. You see that? <laughs> Damn, that bird got scared. Shark's a little tired after the run. Dude, I'm exhausted from that other shark. Whoa. Holy crap. Can I beat my PB again? I don't know. I don't think it's my PB. This thing is not running as much as the other one, but it is fighting pretty good, like a 40 plus injury. This thing's a jumper. Nice. This Pen Fierce 4000 is just working perfect. Just having that glider gear, it's just more fun instead of having a big reel. I mean, look at the jack smell. Dang. Get him in here. Yeah, this thing's definitely smaller, but he's still a good size. Come on. Oh, oh I came off. Oh, God. Oh, he's gone. Okay, quick release. Quick release, I touched it, that counts. I just touched it, dude. Okay, that's number two. I'm gonna guess that was probably a 40 something incher. 40, 43. <sighs> well, of course, the weather says it's supposed to be only cloudy, but sprinkling didn't even bring anything that's waterproof, so I'm soaked. All right, you guys, worst part of the day, gotta be leaving. So today was pretty fun. You know, I was actually not expecting to catch my PB leopard shark and I beat it by about three inches, 54 incher, let's go. And then I hook onto another shark that was probably in its 40s and comes off, but I get to touch its tail right there. I could have probably grabbed it in the water, but I didn't want my socks to get super wet. So yeah, that shark got released with the hook in its mouth and after about two hours of fishing not even a bite so it looks like those two sharks two sharks just came by today and a couple other small ones in the beginning chewed them bait for a little bit but yeah today was fun 
uh, catching some big sharks. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, make sure to like and sub. And stay tuned for more videos coming. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of your weekend. Stay tuned.